hello guys welcome to my channel you are watching how to fix tag in this video i am going to show you how to resolve this issue let me show you this issue this is the issue faulty hardware corrupted page blue screen in windows 10 you can apply these methods to resolve the issue in window 10 and 11 and other version of window so in first step we need to disable the fast startup on windows 10 so how we can disable that go to control panel click on control panel once you click on control panel you need to go for a view by and select the large icon okay after that look for a power options click on this option then after that look for this option choose what the power button does click on this option once you click on this option you need to click on this option change setting that are currently unavailable click on this option and untick this option let's say the tick is selected on your system you need to untick this option first and then click on save changes what this will affect your fast startup will be disabled and your system will not restart it itself okay you need to click on save changes and exit out from this setting and check your issue is solved or not if your issue is still not resolved you need to press window plus r button together and type here ms config okay like this click on ok button we will disable all the other softwares except microsoft running in the background go to services tab here click on this option hide all microsoft services you need to click on as i have already disabled all the option you can see the status is stopped now i need to select disable all after selecting this option disable all okay then click on apply option and then click on ok the third party software will be disabled and disabling does not mean that those software will not run on your system they will run only once you click on those softwares so no harm to your computer you need to restart your system and check if uh, the issue is solved or not since we have uh, disabled the third party software on our system so click on restart and check your issue is solved or not if your issue is still not resolved you need to look for the other method which is command prompt go to cmd option right click on command prompt click on run as administrator you need to click on yes prompt when the prompt opens you need to type here one command sfc space slash scan now sfc stands for system file checker which will scan all the corrupted file inside your windows and repair those and i will tell you the other command after completing this command okay you need to wait for the process to complete okay after completing this command you need to type one more command here to repair your windows image okay this command you will get in a description box you can directly copy and paste okay you need to copy this command and directly paste it on a cmd and hit enter after that and you need to wait for the process to begin and also for the completion of this task this might take 10 to 15 minutes you need to wait for the process once this process is finished you need to restart your system and your issue hopefully will be resolved okay now this is how it works okay this is how this is begins it is 3.8 it will go to 100 percent you need to wait for the process to complete and after that you need to restart your system i am cancelling this process right now you need to restart your system and then i will show you the other command to repair your hard drive issues is okay 
now this command is for checking the ram issues it is related to hardware issue so we are going to check the hardware of ram and repairing it we need to type here md sc hed dot exc and hit enter once you click on hit enter you need to restart your system and your ram will be checked it might take 20 minutes to check your ram and the hardware issues is you need to click on restart if you get any prompt to not perform this task you need to physically restart your system like this you need to click on this option and then click on restart option if these steps are not working on your system i have last fix for you which is the reset go to search bar type a reset this pc you will get this option as well this will be the last fix for you or reinstallation of windows click on get started then you can choose the keep my files and remove everything you can choose as for your wish if your data is important then keep your file will be good for you and reset will take your system to back stage when you fresh install your windows you can choose one by one i suggest you to choose this option locally install if you don't have data then you can choose next option and your pc is going to reset and this might take 2 to 3 hours so make sure you have patience and enough power with your laptop and the desktop if you are still facing blue screen of death so you can change the hardware of your system and then check your issue is solved or not you can see the view apps to be deleted okay these are the apps to be deleted on my system so click on back and click on reset option okay so hope your issue resolved now if your issue resolved then hit like subscribe and share thank you thanks for watching how to fix tech